Alrighty then, time for a video blog. I got up today, supposed to go to work, and as I was fitting to leave, my boss was going to call me, he's like, you don't have to work today. So I'm like, go Bings, go Bings. So, I stayed home. Yeah, sure, I need the money. My finances are going out the window, but, hey, at least I didn't have to work today. Uh, I've done a few videos, been trying to put them on. Uh, YouTube is taking a little longer than MySpace for some reason, I don't know why. And the 35 seconds that I left the house today, uh, saw some people walking down the street, and it hits me. I like to go back in time and strangle the guy that invented pantyhose. Because before that, girls had to wear garter belts and garters. And those are, those are awesome. I mean, come on. Those were, like, sexy. In the 35 seconds I left my house today is probably the 35 seconds that I ran over to my parents' house to get dinner. So, they made dinner, so I ran next door, ate, and came back home. Just a lot going on, in my head anyway. Not a lot going on in general, but only upstairs. Uh, I've been trying to take my medicine, and I've been doing so well with the insulin. You know, I don't know, man. I just, I get to the point where I'm just like, I hate taking medicine, okay? There's side effects to the, the Prozac and stuff. And not trying to be too vulgar, but the, the Prozac makes you uh, think about sex more often. At least it does for me. But at the same time, you cannot achieve satisfaction in that area. So... It's kind of like it causes a problem and then makes the problem worse. I was up my room yesterday. I've done a little bit of laundry today. Last night I played some spades with my brother and all them. Played cards and stuff. Uh, lost. Not a big deal. I don't really care if I win or lose when we play cards. It's just fun to play. So, uh, okay. I'm watching a show right now. It's kind of funny. It's called Accepted, and it's about the guy who starts a college. And there was something super funny in it earlier, and now I have absolutely no idea what it is. I was going to tell you about it. I was going to tell you about a couple other things, and I forgot about those as well. So, okay. I got this thing in my head where I've been thinking about movies and stuff, because I want to go see Hostel too. Some people have been like, it's a bad movie, it's a bad movie. And I'm like, whatever. You know, just hush up. You know, there's a, a friend uh, on my thing. His, his screen name is My Date with Carrie Underwood. And he did a blog. It was really awesome about critics and movies and all that stuff. And I need to see if he'll let me, uh, I should, oh. Dude, you should totally let me, like, copy part of your blog and post it in a bulletin or something. Or my blog. It was awesome. I loved it. So, if you watch this and I, if you uh, don't mind if I do that, let me know. Uh, that thing annoys me. I get tons of emails every day. Okay? And 95% of all my emails and comments are people going, Hey, sing me a song. Hey, sing me a song. You know what? I would just like to have a few comments. Yeah, I mean, I, you know, I mean, granted, I do get some, and I, I love the ones I get. But it's just nice to have some that aren't people going, hey, sing me a song. You know, because I got more that going on than just singing songs. Definitely going to read some out of my Bible tonight. I've just decided that's, that's a must. I must do that. Uh, I think after I get this thing posted, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go to bed. So. I have to go to the bank tomorrow. Fight with the bank gnomes. Because they don't like me. I gotta figure out stuff out of my car. This doesn't exist. I wouldn't get all my crap out of it Saturday. So I'm pretty gonna probably here in the next couple of days I'll be carless. Which really sucks. Oh, this is awesome. I did talk to Allison earlier. NASCAR Allison. She's always fun to talk to. She's really no, she's one of the people you can really have a decent conversation with. Just about, you know, things that are important, and even things that are not important. That's pretty awesome. I need to call a few other people tomorrow. I haven't talked to Allison in a while. Different Allison. I haven't talked to Caitlin. 
I haven't talked to uh, Jamie in forever. I uh, haven't even really talked to Josie much this weekend because she had to go to a wedding. She even bought a dress. I'm excited to see a couple pictures. I don't think I've ever seen her wear a dress like once. Okay, women should wear more dresses. You know, I, I don't. I'm, I don't mean that to be some smell chauvinistic pig away. I just, you know what? I find women extremely, extremely pretty in dresses. Okay. Say, so, I did clean off some of my DVR today. Had a bunch of stuff on there. Some of my movies earlier, and I caught part of a movie earlier. It's like one of my favorite movies of all time, as far as comedies go. And it was uh, Joe Dirt. I love that Joe Dierte. But no, I love that movie. I love his little sayings, uh, keep on keeping on. Life's a garden, dig it. That's funny. He goes, I got poo on my head. <laughs> ah, that's some funny crap there, man. That's some funny crap. I haven't sold any of my shirts yet. Got a bunch of people asking about it, but I haven't sold any. I haven't heard from Taylor whether or not she likes it yet. I haven't really ever talked to her. People always assume that I like talk to her a lot or something. And I really don't. Like, I've only talked to her a couple times on the phone. No, I think maybe three times on the phone. And I've talked a lot to her manager. And I've talked a lot to Emily. So, and I've even emailed with her mom a couple times. I need to get with her mom. Her mom's supposed to send me a couple pictures. And uh, I never got with her about getting it. So, I need to get those. Those are cool. I've gotten pictures up on MySpace. So you should go comment them or something. I'm the biggest attention whore you'll ever meet. I don't know. It's uh, part of my, uh, where I get, I don't know, man. I just, you know, okay, this is, I don't know. I've noticed, I see this a lot on here. People have, you know, I, I look at their pictures a lot. There's so many happy people on here, you know. They're just happy. Okay, you look at it, and they're happy with their friends. They're happy with what they do. You know, they, um... I assume they have friends that they went to high school, friends they went to college with, friends they even went to junior high or elementary school with. And then I'm thinking, okay, you know what? I don't have any of that. I'm not friends with a single person that I went to elementary school, high school, junior high, or college. I'm not friends with anybody. I don't have any friends from any period of my time of my life like that. No. In my personal life, like right here, right now, that I actually physically get a hang out with. Not, I'm not talking about the people I talk to on MySpace. The really cool friends I have there. But most of them don't even live near here. So it's not like we can go hang out. So actual real friends, I've got like Josie and my family. You know? That's it. Those are my friends. I try to make new friends, but I have a lot of trouble making friends because... I don't know why, because I, I trust everybody. I give everybody benefit of doubt. Okay, that's my biggest problem is I trust people way too much. And I have a hard time, like, I mean, you know, I'll be acquaintances with anybody, but that friendship, that hardcore friendship that I would consider you a personal friend, that is not something I give out easy, and that's something that hardly no one knows. And there, there, surprisingly, there's people on here that I have told things to that I'm like, wow, I cannot believe I told that, you know, because I just did, you know. There's just some people I'm comfortable talking about stuff with, and some I'm not. And I can, I'm the kind of person I can generally tell who that person is going to be like right off the bat, okay? Like with with Josie, I'm comfortable telling her anything. Okay, and there's very few people that I'm comfortable telling anything to in this world. Very few people. Okay? And among them are probably... You know... I don't know. You know, I mean... Not very many people, and I know that's horrible, but... I want to, but I just can't. Uh, I mean... There's, I got a friend, Kevin, here, who's actually pretty friendly. He's so far away, I don't ever get to see him. But he knows a lot about me. Uh, Josie. And actually, Emily knows a lot about me. I've told her things that no one else knows. And I don't know why. She's just a very cool person. And for some reason, I just completely trust her. So, 